Hello everybody, welcome back to another RAM upgrade video for our Lenovo S145. So today we have our plastic prying tools, a stick of RAM, and a PH1 screwdriver. First thing we have to do is flip over the laptop, grab our PH1 screwdriver, and remove the 10 bottom screws. So I usually like to start off with the first four short screws in the first row along the speakers. I'm also going to put a photo uh, to show you um, the screws in order by row. So here's the first row. So we got four short screws and then next we have longer screws for the second and third row. So we got three screws here. And then for the third row, we also have three screws. So far, so good. Now let us grab our plastic prying tool. But before, I should probably show you guys the photo of the screws. Here's the first, second, and third row. So first row is four short screws, and then second and third row are the longer screws. All right, so now that we have our plastic prying tool, I kind of just like to gradually start off in the back and then work my way forward. I usually like to take my time too. I know everybody has their own technique, so I make multiple passes. It's gonna gradually go here, there. So yeah, the bottom cover is pretty much all plastic. So you definitely want to be careful. Okay, let me go around a little bit more. Awesome. Here's the bottom cover. All right, so now we can disconnect our battery. So what I try to do usually is I try to go for the connector and I gradually grab it in the center and on the sides until it loosens up. There we go. Yeah, it is kind of tight. Let me give you a little close-up of the connector. See, I was grabbing here, here, and here. Perfect. So now that it's disconnected, we are going to remove this RAM cover. I've actually never seen this RAM cover before. We do have an older Lenovo S145 that we upgraded to, and it did not have a RAM cover like this. So I guess these are the things that holds it in place. Pretty interesting. See, that's my first time seeing these. I did not expect to see that in this laptop. So now we can remove the memory. Easy peasy. So it looks like this is a four gigabyte stick. And oh yeah, by the way, so the computer reads the memory at 2400 megahertz. I did a task manager and I did some screenshots, which I'm gonna put up toward the end of the video. So the next RAM we're going to put in is an 8 gigabyte stick. And uh, I did get this from another Lenovo laptop that we upgraded. So I didn't want it to go to waste. But it is basically a 8 gigabyte stick, uh, 2666 megahertz, but it's only going to read at 2400 megahertz. Uh, like I said, I'll put up some screenshots toward the end of the video comparing it. And I'll also put a screenshot of the shared GPU memory, because I know a lot of uh, people like to ask how much uh, shared GPU memory increased. So I definitely have that screenshot also. So I put back the cover. So far so good. I guess we can reconnect our battery. So here's the old RAM. Okay, now let us reconnect our battery. 
Yeah, it's kind of tight in there. there we go. Awesome. So far, so good. Let me just double check and make sure it's connected. So if you're not familiar with these Lenovo's, so this one in particular has four gigabytes of RAM built in on the motherboard. So let's close it up. And then we're gonna put back our screws. So 10 bottom screws. So I'm gonna start off with the third row. Now the second row. And then the four short screws for the first row. All right, so let me just double check these screws here, make sure everything's secure. All right, I think we can turn it on now. So give it a few seconds and it will recognize the new memory. And let me show you the screenshot. So before and after. So here's the shared GPU memory. It's 4.9 gigabytes now compared to 2.9 gigabytes. And then for the memory itself, we now have 7.7 .7 gigabytes available compared to 3.1 gigabytes available at 2400 megahertz. So one eight gigabyte stick and four gigabytes of uh, memory built into the motherboard, 12 gigabytes total. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Take it easy.